Hey YouTube, Crystal here, and as you can see, as I got my Monster High minis back here in the back, obviously, I'm going to do something Monster High related, and, um, yeah, so, we're gonna get started, because obviously these minis aren't the video, because I, um, I unboxed all of these girls on my channel. I will have a link to that, there will be an I up there in the right hand corner, and I will put a link to these to my Monster High mini playlist because I'm Monster High Funko Pops yay <laughs> um I got I completed my set yay I finally did it so I got Frankie Stein who is number 369 um Draculaura, who is number 370, and then we have Claudine Wolf, who is number 371, and then we have Cleo Denial, who is number 372, and then we have number 373, and it's Laguna Blue. Yes, I got all six, and then we have Skeleta, who is number 374, and she was... And she was the hardest one to get a hold of. I just finally got her. Um, the, the, okay, the, this Skeleta was a Walmart, or supposed to be a Walmart exclusive. And I would just like to announce that why my, my Walmart didn't get any of these Monster High Funko Pops. If they did, I didn't see them. So, yeah. But it... They just kept giving me the run around for this Skeleta for so long and I was eventually, I was just getting to where I was eventually going to give up and then um, I got an email, well, I didn't get an email, I checked my, I was just going through my bank account and it says that they charged, that Pop in a Box charged me $13. I was like, oh, I never got it and then finally I looked up, the tra I found the tracking number and then there she was the next day so yay I was so happy to complete this set because I love love Monster High so like two of my favorites Monster High and Funko Pops how could I pass up okay. <laughs> so yeah we're gonna get started on opening these chicks so yeah if you're ready to see them where I'm going to give you a review on all of these girls. I don't know if I'm going to be able to fit all of them in one video, but I'm going to do them in order. So like we're going to so we're going to see how many we can get in this one video before I have to stop. All right, so yeah, we have Frankie, Dracula, Cla and Claudine. We're going to go ahead and open Frankie first since she is number 369 she is the first one and we're gonna get a look at her box real quick there's there's a cute little frankie on the side and here's the girls you can get which i have all of them yay and there is it from the other side and she you got her little oh, thing from there all right um some of these i picked up from um hot topic and some of them i was able to pick up at Oh, we have a books a million. Yeah, we don't have bar. There's no Barnes and Nobles around here, and she comes. And they all come with a stand, which is fabulous. Because these girls might not stand so well without a stand. <laughs> stand so well. Oh, she's kind of weird in there. Okay, so we're gonna start with the hair, which is totally awesome. It's totally big hair, just like Frankie. She loves big hair. And she's got her cool little costume, like her, isn't that kind of like her gener first generation costume? And she's got these cool striped shoes on. And she even has her little plugs right here under there. Which is totally awesome. And she's got her little stitches and it's like silver and yeah. And she's got her fingernails painted. She's a cool chick. So there's Frankie on her stand. And these are not bobbleheads. These are just regular. Alright, so yeah. Number three, that is number 369. And it is Frankie. Alright, 
And now we have number 370, and it's Draculaura. Um, I love Draculaura. I love her. She's awesome. She's one of my favorite monsters, for sure. She, she is dressed in her first, she looks like she's dressed in her first wave Dracula costume also. She has her cool little, she has cool little earrings and her little bat-like ears and her little things. And she's also got her nails painted and she's got those cool boots that she wears with little hearts on them. And she's got some tights on. Does she have tights? Yeah, I guess so. I don't know. And there she is from the back. Her awesome, awesome ponytails. Who doesn't love Dracula? I love her so, so much. I am glad to add these girls to my collection. Although they are going back in the box. But I thought I would give y'all a little sneak peek slash review of these girls. So there's Draculaura. And don't worry, there will be plenty of pictures at the end. And... I'll probably even insert some pictures in of these chicks. Okay. I'm gonna get some good pictures, so... Be... Oh, and then we have number 371, which is Claudine. Um, I didn't really show the other box because they're basically the same thing. But yeah, I could have, wow. She wasn't in there very well. The other girls was in there good. We're in there good. But she just popped right out. Okay, so here's Claudine Wolf. And she looks like she, and she's wearing her original costume too. And she has her little boots on, and her toenails are painted, and her fingernails. And she's got her little, um, fangs right there, and her little earrings, there's in her ears. She's totally awesome. I love the hair. It's big hair, and it's awesome, and it's so totally Claudine. They did a very good job on these. I'm really loving these. I really, really, really love these. So awesome. Good job, Funko. Um, does anybody know if they're going to be making any more of these dolls? I don't know. I'm just wondering. I'm just curious. Okay. So... I'm just going to discontinue on if I have to do two videos. I will. But yeah, here is um, Cleo Denial, Laguna Blue, and Skeleta Calveras. So this, so here we're going to start with, we're going to push these chicks in the back and we're going to start with Cleo Denial. And there's her little picture on the side. Um, she's number 372. Um, yeah. Pull her on out of there and she's in there good, like little girls. And pop her little stand out and put her box down there and trying to keep the boxes. And she, she is one, probably one of my favorite ones. She has so much detail. They did, they just paid so much attention to detail to Cleo. She's just fabulous. She has her gold belt. She's doing her little Egyptian walk thing stance. And she's got her first generation outfit on, I believe. And there's her, look at these earrings. They're just fab. But look how big they are. They're like bigger than her. And then she's got her little thing that she always has right there. And she's got this gold awesome headband and then she's got all these gold stripes in her hair which is totally awesome and her fingernails are painted gold isn't that gold or is that like bronzy i don't know what that color that is it's kind of hard to see so there is her fabulous hair it's huge she has giant hair i think she has the most biggest hair of all these girls so far so yeah 
I love the Egyptian stance. Too cool. Okay, so there is Cleo. Other girl, along with our other girls back there and they are awesome I'm loving them this is number 373 and it is Laguna Blue and there she is on the side and she is also in her first generation first wave Laguna Blue costume which is totally cool loving her and there she, and she hmm she's pretty close to my favorite one I'm not sure which one of my favorite is. In the video, I will probably decide and let you know. She has her cool little ear fins and this big cool flower. Um, it's that hibiscus, I guess. Um, and she has her costume on that she came with in her first wave doll. She's also got painted nails. And she is just too cute for words. She has her little fish nets on. And yeah. And their little freckles, or those, are those freckles? I don't know. Um, and she's got her little net hair thing on. And her hair is gorgeous. She's got the blonde and the blue. Oh, and she also has her fins on her legs. These do not detach. Woohoo, good job. Because <laughs> I have a lot of Lagunas with no fins. So, good job on that. These stands are like... Tricky. But yeah, and here's number 374, Skelita. The last one that I, the last one, and I finally got her. She's the last one I finally got. I love her. I love sugar skulls. So, yay. There's the side. And she, I believe she's in her first wave outfit too. If she's not, let me know. But I think she is. I have a Skeleta. I don't have a Skeleta in her original outfit. I do have a Skeleta, but she has no outfit on. No clothing. So, yeah. We'll put her, we're going to put her stand on first. That was easier. It's easier to do it the way I just did it. Like, turn her to her side and then look where you can look at the bottom and then line it up. Yeah. So, yay. Um, and she has the biggest hair. For sure. She's totally cool. She has like her little... Look at her little bones. <laughs> it's so cute. Her bones are a little thick. Look at that. So, but it's still cool. Oh, she had this. I noticed she had this in the box. Oh, it was just like a little fuzz. Woohoo, yay. She's, she's in really good shape. I like her. She's the only one that doesn't have painted nails, but I guess she's a skeleton, so... Maybe skeletons don't paint their nails, but I love her. She's awesome. There she is. There is her hair, her awesome, awesome hair. She's got her gorgeous hair, and it's orange and black, and I just love her. All right, so yeah. One thing I forgot to mention was these girls do, their necks do twist back and forth. Some of them got more mobility than her because their hair is a little bit different. But yeah, they do twist at the neck in case anybody was wondering. I just didn't put that in there. Here are our, here are my ghouls that I opened, I unboxed today. I hope everybody enjoyed them and please stay tuned to the end because there's going to be pictures of all these girls at the end. So yeah, if you like these girls, comment below and tell me which one is your favorite. And the, I mean, if you click Funko, also comment below and tell me which is your favorite Funko that you have. All right. So yeah, click that little eye up there in the corner of the in the right corner, and it will lead you to a link of these girl these uh, Master Hand Minis behind here of their un of their unbaggings because I did a boxing on all of these girls oh, except for one because I had got seventeen and I went back and I found the other girl that I didn't have. So yeah, if you like this video. 
please be sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe click that little bell so you'll get all my newest videos when they come up all right so yeah i love monster Hay. i was so excited to open these thanks for watching remember to like oh and my favorite of all it's the close one which one is my favorite of all of these i can't pick one but the closest one closest i am to picking one would be cleo i love her she just over the top like so just like cleo they did such a good job because she's just over the top all right thanks for watching remember to like and subscribe bye bye youtube oh and if you want to see more funko videos i'll also you can also click that eye up there and there'll be a there'll be a link to my playlist my funko playlist thanks for watching remember to like and subscribe bye bye youtube